Hey guys, it is Lexi the Nun here, and today I'm back with another episode of Minecraft Comes Alive. So last episode we did more work on my house, and just today I was going to another and getting a lot of quartz. And as you can see, I have a lot of birch wood, and I've been cutting down those trees and replanting. Ow! Oh my goodness! Alden, Alden. Settle down. I've been outside cutting trees. That is where I have been. So I got all this wood, and I only have 60 blocks of quartz, and I have to do that whole entire roof out of quartz. So I've been going to the nether and stuff like that, and stuff, stone bricks, all this stuff, and I have a lot of glowstone. So I'll be able to do that. Oh, this episode, what I wanted to do, but I wanted to wait until I was recording again. I want to make an enchanting table. So let's just get one another. Three. Let's make this book. Then we will make the enchanting table. That goes in the middle. There we go. And achievement get enchanter. So right now, we're just gonna plop it somewhere. Oh, and down here, I did something really cool. Enchant- oh, oh my goodness. The potion. Oh no, these aren't grown yet. Oh wait, yeah they are. Yeah, I think that they're all grown. Besides those two in the corner. Yeah, because I just got a lot from that. So I'll probably bring chest down here, but then I have my burning potion, so, which I haven't done any potions just yet. So let's go up and get a chest. Okay. Let's place this down so we can have a little bit of fight in Okay, I can still open it. Good. Okay. So that is how it will be with the chest. And I want to go to sleep real quick, and then I'll show you the house yeah. so far. And so I've just been mainly going to the nether, cutting the trees, all that good stuff, because the floor is going to be birch planks. And now I have all these birch logs. I'm going to turn them into planks, but let's Okay, okay I have the quartz. Let's go over to the house. And I don't have a crafting table. Just bring both, because I just want to get there and back. And if you see that little thing I have over there, that's just Kendall the dog. So I've done that part of the roof. This is going to be the main idea for the roof. And that's going to be a window. But this is all I've got done. And I really like the floor to be birch wood. But yeah, let's see how many stairs I can make with 60. Let's make as many as we can. 40, exactly. And then I did have dirt last time. I had like 10 dirt. Okay, that should be enough. Then I did like... And I literally, I know that I'm wasting dirt, but I'm just too lazy to do that. Okay, this was the exact spot. Then I've just been going down. So over here, I'm just gonna, oh, I only have one more around this, so let's finish this. But yeah, just because I was getting annoyed of going to the nether and getting all those cords because it took forever, I started on the floor. So I think that I will have enough wood for the first floor. And possibly for the second, but I have to finish the roof before I start on the second floor. So, okay, well, it's this. Oh, yeah. Okay. The pre fire. Okay, this is how it go. There. Okay, and that lines up. So then you go like this, you have to go down. That's only for the outside part. I don't do it on the inside. It just looks a lot cooler if you do it like this. So, if I do it like, oops. Uh, I think that I have to go one more out. Because this should match up. Oh! <gasps> Poop. Okay, 
Okay, now let's not go by the creeper. Let's go through the back door. Oh my goodness. Okay. Let's go through here and go up the staircase that I made with dirt. Worst staircase in the world, but it will do. So, finish this side of the roof now. So I think that I'll need more stone brick right here. So. Okay, I think that that's it. And these are going to be slabs. And if I go right here. Wow! I don't like falling. <laughs> Yes, it's not with me here. Let's try to do it. Just at least this part. Okay, that worked. Just then we can get that part done. But yeah, that should not even take a whole stack. So, and I have a stack of logs. So, I think that I'll have a lot of extra wood also. And that's good because I have like all of those trees, but I don't really cut them. I just get them whenever I need them. Okay, let's try to do this without falling. Let's get the, oh, sink. Hopefully we have enough to at least finish this. Okay, we will. Go up, and then we go in like that. There we go. Okay. So then... I think that this is gonna go like. I don't know how far it goes. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So, does this count? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Then it would go in like that. So, I think that this is how it's gonna be. So, let's fill in these parts like that I think and then you go up one more then down I think that you leave it like this because that's four down okay so now let's work on the floor okay this I'm gonna go jump down so I'll go and pull this floor and then I'll be right back to you guys. Okay, so I finished the floor and I think it looks really nice. And I went ahead and made some birchwood stairs. And this is how much birchwood I have left. And I think I don't want the ceiling to be like. I don't want it to be too closed in. But I don't really know what I would do upstairs. Because I'm thinking if I close this in like this and then it will be like two long windows and then I make this into like a bedroom if that would look nice like a girl's bedroom I know that I want a kitchen right here so let's just here I'll go to the workhouse really quick oh wait I need there we go workhouse Teleport to the workhouse and I have to get more of those creeps out. And I'll go to home, teleport, there we go. So then I can kind of do the layout of what I want. So I'll have like the fridge here. Counter, 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 counter. I don't know. Like, so fridge will be like that. And then I'll have a counter. I know that I want cupboards like right here so cupboards right there it's like i want the counter just to go like that so cupboards will go above it and then i want our table kitchen table maybe we could eat over here so like the chairs i would do like and then 
table. Just representing everything. And then right here, maybe like a little, little seating area. A little table in front of it. So, that. It's like a little seating area, no table. And then, hmm. Or we could eat over here. Uh, so hard. So, I know that I want this to be kitchen. Fridge, counters, cabinets. And then I'll have the table right here. I feel like I'll make it a three. So there will be enough room. And then the table. And then I think that I might move the door to the outside. Over here. So like right here. So the door to the outside. I like it like this there we go so then over here we could have our TV so stand and our little TV and then I would do a big couch or we would just make a humongous living room so this it won't be made out of dirt this is just to go around so i think that, that will be like the long couch and i'll have like slabs right there and to make it look all nice so in there and then this will probably be a bedroom so then there's the door to the bedroom and then that could be a little girl's bedroom or guys whichever one we have first that will be their bedroom then I could have like bunk beds for them there. And then I think that the stairway would be like right here. Going up there. I don't there's not a lot of room over there. So I would put it up here for like we could have games and maybe a like another TV. It would kinda of look like a flat screen, so Oh my goodness. <sighs> okay, that is not right. I could have just stood on here the whole time. There we go. So, like, flat screen because the floor, I think that all have slabs are right above the cabinets. It's right above there, so it would be like just laying on something. And then I'm gonna just have like some seats over here probably. But then let's try, do I want it to match or do I want like, here, just stick with me. Just trust me, I'm not gonna actually cheat, I'm showing you everything. So stone, what, how would stone brick stairs be? The stone brick house. Like, say that we did that. Oh, of course I'm gonna break these and then I'll make the actual bricks well stone bricks if I don't if I like it so let's see how this would come up if I need to move it more towards the door or more away I think that will be just fine like the floor is gonna be right th oh I forgot about that the floor is gonna be about here let me just do it like that so there we go and then i could just well i would want the floor to be well the floor would have to be this okay just imagine it i don't really have to imagine it because i'm doing it so that would be how it was so when you would walk in see i feel like stone brick and stone brick just like But it works nice to the 
height, I think. Right here, it's going to be hard, though. I feel like I need to do it one more. So, let me just throw that away. There we go, now I know where. So it's going to be like that. And then, so I cheated for that. So that would be. Then it would go into this big room. And then, until you get to there, you can. Oh, ah, I keep forgetting. You could jump, and then. I think that that would be better. So when you walk in, it's like right there. But I feel like it should be four. Because it's like not lined up. Or we could just all move it one. Because I kind of only want it to be three to not take up too much space. Four would be better. Where's the door? I really only want three, so we're just going to have to destroy that. So when you go up, walking up the stairs. Go up here, you can turn, and then you go into the flawless room with the cool TV. And over here will just be nothing. It'll just be an empty place, but I'll light it up so then no mobs spawn and then kill anyone in my family. But yeah, so that will be the kitchen. This will be the little dining area. This will be a little couch. This will probably be a bedroom. Up here will be the... Or... Up here will be the TV room, I think. And then I think, oh, I'm gonna go back into Sorrel. I think that over here should be another bedroom. Maybe it should be cut off like that, and then you walk into the hallway. It's like a door here, and then a door there. Okay, let's break this part. Oh, there's like a door there and a door here. So then two doors there. But this seems like too tiny of a room. But I don't know. I think that this is the main layout that I'm going to be doing for my house. So um, stairs. I don't know what, yet, what stairs yet. But I'll put stairs here. And then the floor floor so that will give me enough jump space and it will leave enough room up there then dining room little couch area two rooms right here I feel like we shouldn't nah it's okay it can be tiny I might just end up doing this it doesn't need to be that long of a halt that it's not it can be snug go in, you can go either way. That will give it a little bit more room so it's a little more even. So stairs. And yeah, that's the layout of the house. And if you have any more ideas for what I should do that, leave them in the comments below. So guys, I think that I'm going to end this episode here. Thank you so, so much for watching. So this is going to be the layout of my house and I will be going um, off screen, just going to another, getting a lot more quartz to finish off the roof. And please comment on what you would like me to talk about in my next episode. So then it's not just, okay, I'm placing this block here, here. So just comment down something that you'd want me to talk about during my next episode of Minecraft Comes Alive. And bye! Subscribe and become a member of the Arctic family.